Third and 16 after the penalty. Cousins, well protected, that pass a little bit high and incomplete. Off the hands of the intended receiver, Josh Dotson, at the quarterback position. Another terrific year for Thomas in an offense that has really struggled. That pass from Osweiler, right on cue to Thomas. Far in this game, they're playing very well. well here's Brandon McManus, who has had his struggles this year. He's been one of the better kickers the last couple of years, but eight missed field goals this time. He is good. After the penalty, third and 12. As they snap it just outside the 35, Cousins well protected, then feeling the pressure, and that pass is incomplete. Season have had to endure, endure some disappointments. And Eric Ebron making some things happen for that offense. Anderson bounces to the outside. C.J. Anderson starting to put together some terrific games down the stretch of the season. And into the, the rhyme and Christmas spirit. Here's Cousins. Under pressure, feeling it coming from the backside. That pass is caught. Ryan Grant. Only their third first down of the half. As they look for their first points. Cousins, three of his first ten. He's completed his last two. Slinging it. That pass is caught. It's Grant again. Off the seam inside Broncos territory. A pickup of 32. So here's Justin Hopkins recovering from that partially torn hip muscle. And he sustained in mid-October, returned from IR, and on here as he converts a 26-yard chip shot. In the play action, will suit the offense well. One play call. This is Anderson showing the burst. All the way out to the 35-yard line. Really, Demarius Thomas, who is lined up in the slot right here, is his sure reliable weapon in the pass game. Only four healthy wide receivers up. Osweiler, football is loose. Washington has it. Zach Vigil on the recovery and disaster for Denver. In the last two weeks, have been able to turn it around again. Could be the final play before the two minute warning. Second and 13 over the middle. It's caught. Jamison Crowder for the Washington touchdown. Caught up around the league, week 16. On the Verizon halftime report, second and nine. Osweiler to his check down. This is Booker eluding tacklers. What a maneuver by Booker in the open field. And mark off the yardage in Denver's favor nonetheless. First and ten. Osweiler from the gun hit on the release. That pass is intercepted. DJ Swearinger making a play for Washington. Here come the skins and the blitz. They pick it up, and that pass is caught. Over the middle, it's Jordan Taylor. All the way down to the 30, but that clock is moving. 27 seconds and counting. Well, they're inside of McManuson's range here. Third and 10. Osweiler's pass near side is caught. That's Isaiah McKenzie. McKenzie, though, not getting nope. out of bounds. And I'm not sure they're going to be able to stop this clock. Can't spike it. Fourth Huge down. mistake by McKenzie, and that will bring us to halftime. It's granted motion. Here come the Broncos. Cousins steps up. And has Grant. Grant. Plenty of real estate in front of him. Finally tackled at the Denver 20. And the sixth of his career. Skins three of eight on third downs. Cousins here on third and nine. Off the seam over the middle. It's caught. Down to the 10-yard line. This will be enough for a Washington first down. That's Brian Quick. Cousins, all day to throw, going end zone, and he is intercepted by Will Parks. So Osweiler and company begin from their own 20. After the pick by Parks. Osweiler is buried, and guess who? It's Ryan Kerrigan again. He has been a monster. Starting in place of Justin Simmons, who they had to shut down a couple of weeks ago with that ankle injury. They've got a huge defensive play for the Broncos. That pass is caught. That's Bibbs out of the backfield. First down and more for the former Bronco, forced out of bounds by Tlaib and Brandon Marshall by Washington to their practice squad, and here he is facing his old team. 
And only his second game with the Skins. Cousins throwing a dart. That's Duxin. Inside the Denver 30, it'll be a first and 10. Roby has really started to come into his own. Fourth year player, former first round pick out of Ohio State. Had his 17th pass defense earlier. Ties the most by a Bronco defender in the last 10 years. The league leader in tackles entering week 16. On second and 12, Osweiler is sacked again. It's Kerrigan. Third time they've gotten to Osweiler. And of course, Rob Kelly, whom we just mentioned. On second and six, Cousins taking a shot. Daxon is wide open and strolls into the end zone. 48 yards from Cousins. As Grant comes over in motion, they don't communicate properly and they completely drop Josh Doxson as he runs right past the cornerbacks en route to an easy team has gone on. You can see that they really miss Emmanuel Sanders and Cody Latimer. They just haven't been able to get anything going with their wide receivers. Osweiler is sacked again. Number four for this Washington defense. Massage takes his sleep very seriously. He is someone who is so meticulous with his mental and physical preparation. As you see the football came loose, well, let's see what the officials determine here. Was P. Ryan down by contact? No signal yet. Football appeared to come out clearly yep. before his knee hit the ground. It was Doma Topeko and Von Miller able to strip it for the Broncos. Yeah, I think it was actually Von Miller is the one that had his right hand on the football. What a play by Von Miller. His victory that they scored last week in Pittsburgh albeit in a controversial finish. Osweiler's pass complete over the middle. Booker football comes loose and now they say incomplete. Possessed the ball and took at least three steps. Therefore it was a complete catch. He fumbled the ball. It was recovered by Washington at the 50 yard line. Each game as it comes but in this league you just you just can't take anything for granted. On third and six, Cousins off balance throw, has his man, it's Vernon Davis for the Redskins touchdown. A brilliant pass by Cousins. He's in the backfield, and Davis just runs right by him down the field in a beautiful pass under pressure by Cousins. Physical game last week, especially against the run against the Arizona Cardinals. Osweiler is going to use his legs. He'll run for the first down, and he's got that more. Now close to midfield. Eli Manning, you know, there could be a lot of big-name quarterbacks out on the market at the same time in the offseason. Third and ten, nicely thrown by Osweiler right up the seam to C.J. Anderson. Anderson busting it in for the Denver touchdown. Osweiler from the gun has Anderson wide open as they convert for two points. Brandon McManus. Here's the onside kick to the far side of the field. It's fielded easily by the Redskins. That's their tight end, Niles Paul.